for me very early on, I noticed that I was, uh, I was folding under pressure. I'd be out at practice, killing it. Then I'd come to qualify and I'd make a dumb mistake or competition. I'm like, what's going on? And I looked very closely inside and read a lot of books about sports psychology and mental mindset and, and things like that. And it changed my life and changed my career, turned me into a champion. And, um, for me, um, so, you know, physical activity is huge. Um, I sauna, right. Which replicates me being in my race suit in a 140 degree car. Um, I, uh, do, um, some CrossFit, um, and I have just kind of a training regimen that I've worked with a trainer to work out. Um, I do yoga. Some people may laugh, but my, what I have found in mental solitude, uh, flexibility, mobility, and just a reset has been incredible. Um, you know, meditation and visualization is a, a very huge key of mine um, prior to races. You know, the brain does not decipher from, you know, when you get into that flow state, right? And you can get to it very simply by just focusing on breathing for, you know, a minute and you get into a nice flow Zen state um, and you can visualize activities, you know, whether it's you guys training for what you may encounter uh, or me training for a track, um, you know, I just sit and relax and drive laps in my, in my mind. And, and that prepares you, you know, it starts to create muscle memory. And, and um, so that's been a huge key for me. Um, simple reaction exercises, um, you know, throwing a ball up against a wall and doing math while you're, while you're catching the ball and just, keeping those, those channels all open, you know, it's all about movement and not letting, uh, you know, not letting those muscles get lazy. I mean, that's, that's what it is. Right. I mean, um, and so for me, um, you know, I have, have some routines. Um, I focus on eating, um, eating very clean, making sure that, uh, you know, I'm staying hydrated, drinking a minimum of, of half my body weight in ounces. Um, so, you know, again, you weigh 200 pounds, you do a hundred ounce of water minimum, uh, every day, uh, which is more challenging than, uh, than you would think. Um, but, uh, it's very important. And I've noticed huge differences, um, eating clean. It's, it's changed my life, my focus, uh, my fitness and, and how I look and how I feel. So, um, yeah, I mean, uh, quite a lot of things, um, you know, being a, a professional athlete, uh, that, that you need to focus on, but I would imagine very similar for you guys. I mean, you guys are doing way more um, way more physical activity than, than I am. I mean, I've got 1200 horsepower to do the work for me. And, you know, I see you guys walking around those 80, hundred pound packs on your backs doing work. I mean, when I visit, visit, uh, bases, you know, I see, see you guys doing training and I'm just oh, unbelievably impressed with mindset and your guys, uh, commitment. Like it's, it's next level and inspiring to me.